And now for the Lightning Jim adventure, a lawman's bed. In the plain town of Midville, a group of men were gathered in the Bighorn Cafe. Oh, go on, yes. Dad. Don't give us that. <laughs> yes, sir, boys. There's plenty of gold up in them Black Hills. Why don't you hightail it up there, Dad? Dad? I said, why don't you go up to the Black Hills? That's what I said. There's plenty of gold. You ought to go up there, Trigger. <laughs> <laughs> well, kind of got the drop on you that time, Trigger. Yeah, the old buzzard can't hear nothing. Yeah, never mind the old man, Trigger. I got something to tell you and the boys. Call him over here. Sure. Hey, you fellas, quiet down. Boss wants to tell you something. <laughs> boys? Now, while we was out on the range today... The Citizens Committee in Midville appointed a new sheriff. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need no sheriff. No, shake the law around here. <laughs> hey, uh, who took the job, boss? Boy, the new sheriff is young Bill Barr. Bill Barr? Uh, uh, holy uh, smoke. Uh, hey, uh, his uh, old uh, man uh, runs the Circle J Cattle Ranch. Yep. Yeah. Why, he's just a court. Ain't more than 20. Yeah, Why, no, 20. 20. Well, 20. if young Bill knows what's good for him and his paw... He'll be running the sheriff's office always. Yeah, yeah, I'll do right. it. Come there, Jake. Hey, here he comes now, boy. Well, look who's here, boys. Our new sheriff. Well, what can we do for you, Bill? I'm arresting one of your men, Slade. Oh, I see. Who is it? What's the charge? I got a warrant here charging Trigger with the murder of Ed Mason. Why, well, you young well, I'm sorry. Hold on, Trigger. Put that gun away. You letting him get away with saying... Shut up. I'll do the talking. All right. Quiet, all of you. Yeah. Sheriff, I figure you must have made a mistake. Now, I'm willing to pass it by this time, seeing as how you're kind of new with this law badge business. Ed Mason is shot down cold. He was drilled in the back, and I got witnesses to prove Trigger done the shooting. That's a lie. Mason drawn first. How about it, boy? Well, wait a minute now. Sheriff... I, are you ready to tear up that warrant? Nope, it's my duty to serve this warrant, and I aim to take Trigger to jail. Is that final? I reckon so. It's up to the court to decide if he's guilty or not. Come on, Trigger. Put him up, Sheriff. I've got you covered. You can't get away with this. Never okay. mind the talk. Take his gun, Trigger. Sure. That's better. I'll take that warrant, too. Just because the Citizens Committee says you can be Sheriff don't mean nothing. There's only one kind of law around these parts, and that's my law. Give me the sheriff's badge, Trigger. Sure. It's a plum pleasure. Here you are, boss. Well, well, a nice new badge. All shined up, too. <laughs> Put it on, Jake. Yeah. Yeah. Jake <laughs> might as well be the sheriff. <laughs> oh, wait, wait a minute. Hold on, boys. I got a better idea. Seeing as how some of the folks around here think that we ought to have a real sheriff, I reckon we can point one ourselves. Who wants to be sheriff? Oh, not, <laughs> not, not me. It's too yeah. dangerous. Yeah. Yeah. How about yeah. you, Trigger? Huh? Imagine me sitting around a jail yeah, all Trigger. day. <laughs> hey, how about old Dad Morgan? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, wait now. That's not a bad idea. Sure. Hey, come here, Dad. Hey. Come here. I ain't done nothing, Mr. Flame. <laughs> <laughs> well, nobody said you did, Dad. I just want you to pin this badge on your shirt, that's all. What? Never mind. You're the new sheriff. The sheriff? Well, Bill Barnes is the sheriff. No. 
You're the sheriff now. Yes, yes. He's the sheriff, all right. <laughs> now, Bill, you can go back to your old man and the citizens' committee and tell them Dad Morgan has taken over your job. All right, Slade. You've got the draw. But I'm warning you, Mid Bill's going to have some law and order, and it won't be your kind. Get moving, son, or I'll have the new sheriff throw you in jail for disturbing the peace. <laughs> Hey, 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 wait a minute. What's the matter, Dad? Hey? What's the trouble? Why, doggone it, the sheriff went off and clean forgot his bed. <laughs> yeah, it's no use, Bill. Slade and his gang have got the upper hand, and you can't fight them alone. But if the honest ranchers and folks in town had organized and fight, we could lick Slade. Sure, sure, but you can't make them see that. They want law and order, but they won't fight for it. Yeah, I'm afraid that's the size of it. Let Dad Morgan be Slade Sheriff, and you come back and help me with the Circle J. No, Paul. I'm not through yet. But you can't fight them alone. I don't aim to. What do you mean? I'm going to get the one man who can beat Slade to the draw. Who's that? Lightning Jim, the United States Marshal. <laughs> Yes, it was the fearless and courageous United States Marshals who helped the troopers and local peace officers to bring law and order to the wild frontier country of the Old West. Those exciting and thrilling days when bandits, desperados, and hostile Indians roamed the plains come back to us now in the colorful adventures of United States Marshal Lightning Jim Whipple and his faithful companion and deputy, Whitey Larson. We join the Marshal and his deputy around a campfire on the trail. By golly, Lightning, that pick and smells plenty good, I tell you. Yes, you sure does. Oh, no, see, see, yeah, Blackie thinks that that's good, too. Hey, she's got almost as big appetite as you have, Whitey. Oh, it's that. Yeah, and the next time you bring her along on a trip, I'm going to charge you for Blackie's food. Why, she eats more than a horse. More than a horse. Yeah, more than two horses. Hey, get that bacon off the fire before it burns hey, up. Yo. Oh, you beneath me, that's all burned up. <laughs> Serves you right for talking so much. And you don't get no oh, more, neither. Oh, fine thing. Uh, where's the business? Right here. While you uplift that coffee can off the oh. fire, too. Mmm, mmm. This bacon of mine is sure delicious. All right, all right. <laughs> oh, oh, this, this coffee can is hot. Look out to be uh, careful, you uh, drop it. Well, but uh, I'm fooling. Hey, now, buddy. <laughs> oh, oh, you beneath me, <laughs> Of all the clumsy oh. donkeys. Now, there goes a coffee all over the ground. Yo, but that ain't the worst part. What's the matter? You get burned with a hot coffee? No, but them sifting in the biscuits. <laughs> That's right, Sunday. Give him a horse laugh. All right, all right. Go ahead and laugh like a hyena. <laughs> See, even Blackie's laughing at you. Yo, yo, you swear that you don't get no breakfast, Blackie. Never mind, Blackie. Your master's going to go hungry, too. <laughs> hey, hey Lightning, like somebody's calling. Yeah, and he's riding fast like he's in trouble. Oh, boy. Uh, uh. Hold it. Howdy, mister. Howdy. Well, hello there, pup. Yes, he's making friends with you already. Say, she's a fine-looking dog, mister. Oh, I tell you, she's plenty smart to tell you. Yes, yeah, she knows a heap more than the master. Oh, if that's all yeah. well, see, I think she's smarter than your horse, Thunder, Andy. Oh, how about that, Thunder? <laughs> <laughs> Say, that's the biggest black horse I've ever seen. Must be about uh, 16 hands at least. Yeah, you're a little short, mister. He's 18 hands high. Oh, smoke, what a horse. Well, if his name's Thunder, you must be Lightning Jim. That's right. My name's Bill Barnes. I'm from the Circle J Ranch near Midville. Glad to know you, Bill. This is my cook, Whitey Lost. Yes, yeah, see, where you get that cook business? <laughs> well, look at your pants. Ain't they all messed up with flour and biscuit dough? Yes, yeah, so <laughs> I'm going to lose my temper <laughs> like Gallus, and then you've all shot. The government better be looking for new more <laughs> <laughs> You see, Bill, when Whitey ain't falling down and spilling coffee and sitting in biscuits, he kind of acts as much better. I see. <laughs> yes, eh, now listen, Bill. He does all the talking, but I do all the work. Oh. I catch the bandits and he gets the credit. <laughs> well, I wouldn't let him get away with it. Neither, no, neither would I. It's confidential. I hope he don't care. Oh, don't worry. You can't get rid of me that easy. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Bill, the way you come galloping up here, I thought you might be in some kind of trouble. I am in trouble. Is that so? Yeah. 
We need your help, Lightning. Uh, who's we? The honest folks that live around Midville. There's a gang of outlaws and rustlers that are running the town. Can't get the boys to fight, so I thought maybe that you'd help me. I see. Let's go over and sit by a campfire, and you can tell us the whole story. Sure. Say, you and the lightning, that staunch like some action. Yeah, you want some action, Wendy? Oh, you bet your life. All right, stir up the fire, heat up some more Every coffee, and fry some more bacon. Yeah, no, have it. And you might scrape that flour and dough off your pants, too. There's enough there for another batch of biscuits. Yeah, yeah, but I told you I ain't Now, don't to... argue. You wanted action, so let's have it. All right, that <laughs> give you some action. I trick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys. Now, we got some work to do tonight. Yeah. What's up, boss? We're going after the Circle J cattle. Yep. Yeah. Jeff Barnes is out yeah. there. Yeah, that's right. About time we showed Jeff Barnes and young Bill who's boss in the yeah, yeah, you're right. right. Sure. Sure. Circle J right. has some good stock on the range, and we can get it. Yeah. Well, yeah. 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 we ought to get it. Hey, boss, here comes your sheriff. Oh, yeah. oh, look out, boys. It's the sheriff. <laughs> well, you catch any bandits yet, Dad? <laughs> no. I ain't aiming to catch bandits. But they done slapped a whole lot of you in jail. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want, Dad? Listen, Mr. Slane, I don't want to be sheriff no more. Why not? Hey! Why don't you want to be sheriff? That's what I said. I don't want to be sheriff. <laughs> Go on back to the jail. Well, what for? I ain't done nothing. You can't put me in jail. <laughs> <laughs> There's one lamp, one lamp. All my life, I've been prospecting for gold, and I never heard of nobody finding a gold mine in the jail. Come on, boys. Let's make the sheriff dance. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> now the Circle J cattle is arranging near Cedar Gulf. And here's what we're going to do. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, come on, Blackie. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's a good dog. Yeah, don't worry about Blackie. She won't get lost. Well, I just wasn't taking no chances. Well, we're almost there, boys. Circle J is down below us. In that valley on there. Something, Jupiter. What's wrong, Bill? Look, down there in the valley. You mean me, like me. That's the fire. Yeah, and that fire's at the Circle J. Come on, boys. Let's go thunder. <laughs> Thank the Lord you get back safe. What happened, Paul? Now they set fire to the house and rustled their herd out as Peter goes. What? Dirty thieving pack of coyotes. Yeah, they wasn't satisfied with burning the house and stealing the cattle. They drilled three of the boys right in that herd. Uh, so don't down killers. There you are, like them. That's Jake Slade's way of getting back at me for trying to be sheriff. We got to get them. Let's go. What's going to happen when Lightning Jim and Whitey meet Jake Slade and his gang? You'll hear the exciting climax of this thrilling Lightning Jim adventure in part two, which follows immediately. And now for part two of the Lightning Jim adventure, A Lawman's Badge. A gang of outlaws and rustlers headed by Jake Slade had terrorized the folks around the plains town of Midville. They stole cattle and were in control of the town. Young Bill Barnes, son of a local rancher, sought help in his fight against Slade. He went to Fort Anderson and brought Lightning Jim and his deputy Whitey Lawson back to Midville. When they arrived at the Barnes ranch, they found the house burning and the cattle gone. A few hours later... Yeah, boys, the fire's all out now. 
There isn't much left of the house. No, it's just burned down to the ground. Sorry we didn't get you sooner, Mr. Barnes. Yeah, so am I. But, Paul, how did they set fire to the house without you knowing it? I heard some shooting down in the South Range. So me and the boys who was here went down to see what was going on. Did you see anybody? No. When we came back, the house was burning. Then Pete come riding in from Cedar Gulch, said a gang of rustlers shot down three of her boys and made off with her herd. That's all. Till you come up. Did Pete recognize any of the rider? No, it was too dark. He wasn't close enough. Well, it was Slade's gang, all right. Marshal, I reckon Bill's told you about the trouble we've been having. Yeah. Slade didn't like the idea of Bill taking over the job of sheriff. Yeah, I went into the cafe to arrest one of these men, and they got the drop on me. Pulled off my badge and give it to old Dad Morgan. Is he one of Slade's men? No, he's an old prospector. He's kind of deaf and wouldn't hurt nobody. And he's the sheriff now. Yep. Looks like this Slade Jasper don't have much respect for the law. Well, right now he is the law in Midville. Bill tells me that you can't get the ranchers and folks in town to fight Slade. That's right, Marshal. You can see why. Burning down her house, stealing her cattle, killing her boys. That's Slade's way of getting even with Bill. But, golly, I'd like to get my hands on that nigger. Yeah, I'd like to meet up with him right now. I'd blast his head off. Come on, Lyca, let's get out. Hold on, Bill, not so fast. You still hanker on being sheriff of Midville? Sure. All right. You want to show folks you can do the job according to law. So far, we ain't got no proof it was Slade's gang who burned the house and stole the cattle. But it must have been Slade's gang. Sure, we got good reason to think that, but we got to prove it. We can't go in town and shoot down Slade because we think he's guilty. That's right, Bill. Well, what do you suggest, Lightman? I got a hunch maybe we can smoke Slade and his gang into the open. Yeah? Bill, who was the man you was aiming to arrest? A fellow they called Trigger. He killed Ed Mason and helped rustle the Mason cattle. All right, that's where we're going to start. Mr. Barnes, you can help us, too. Sure, I'll do anything you say, Lightman. You go around to the ranches and gather up all the men you can get hold of and bring them back here. Sure. I want them to see what's happened here and talk to them. Bill, you and White and me are going in town and see the sheriff. <laughs> Better leave the dog out here, Waddy. Yo, uh, Blackie, you stay here with the horses now. No use knocking. Dad's so deaf he wouldn't hear. Well, Lightning, what you know about that? The sheriff is sleeping on the yard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he's gone plenty of wood, too. <laughs> Gally, I think somebody could steal a yell and he wouldn't even know the difference. Well, I guess I'd better wake him up. I'm going to shoot in the sawdust box. Don't you, don't you. Take it easy, Dad. Hey, why is Bill Barnes? Yeah, fine sheriff you are. Hey, what's that? I said you're a fine sheriff. No, ain't. I don't want to be sheriff. <laughs> why don't you quit? Oh, Slade won't let me. Then Bernie's hired. I got to stay here in jail. Mine ain't done nothing. <laughs> here, Bill. You here. take this badge and you be the sheriff and let me go on out of here. What do you do? I... Hey, who are these fellas? This is Lightning Jim. Who'd you say? Lightning Jim, the United States Marshal. That's all. Howdy, Chef. This is my deputy, Whitey Larson. Kit Carson? No, no Whitey Larson. <laughs> hey! I said my name is Whitey Larson. Hey! Larson! Huh? Larson! Yeah? I give up. Well, <laughs> I give up. I used to know Carson down in Dodge City. No, I give up. Well, what's the matter? Is it all after you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do you boys want? <laughs> We're going to help you to be sheriff. You go. Hey, no, no, give me a minute. What's going on? Out there? Come on, let's find out. Good work, Michael. You got the gun right out of his hand. Reach for the sky, mister. Quick. Hey, what's the big idea? That dog was aiming to bite me. Yo, and her aim was good, too. I think she got some of your pants, by golly. Get his guns, Bill. Sure. Hey, Lightning, somebody in tight thunder from the heat came forth. Yeah, looks like this Jasper was aiming to get away with him. That's a lie. 
You can't prove that. Well, we don't need no more proof, mister. Hey, what's going on here? About time you were showing up. Hey, what took you so long? Couldn't find my gun. Better get it now. Hey, oh, stop shooting. Do you want to shoot that. somebody? Who do you want me to shoot? Nobody. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? Jeff, this man tried to steal my horse. He did? Yeah, arrest him. Oh, but I can't do that. He's one of Jake Clay's men. Jake had bashed my head off. You arrest him or I'll put you in jail with him. No, now you can't do that. Well, then put him in jail now. Hey, you wait till Jake Slade hears about this. When he gets back in town, he'll show you who's the law around here. Go on, Sheriff. Take him inside and lock him up. Remember, the government will back you up. You mean the government will protect me? Sure. I'm appointing you my deputy marshal. Well, I'll be dead burned. Why didn't you say so for? Get moving there, Trigger. Come on. Get moving there before I start shooting. You pay for this, Morgan. I can't hear you, but I can shoot. <laughs> Gallus Lightning, the old man thinks it's real important. <laughs> he sure does. Well, well, Slade made the old man sheriff, and we're seeing that he carries out the law. Well, so that trigger fella thought he was going to steal thunder. Yeah, looks like it. Yeah, I told you Blackie was smart dog. Yeah, she won't let him get away. Come, Blackie, you're a good dog, all right. And what's our next move, Lightning? Well, I reckon your father's got the boys together. You ought to be waiting for us at the ranch. Yeah, Paul, have him there, all right. Yo, but then what about this Slade feller? Uh, how are we going to get him? Boys, I got a plan in mind, and if it works, we might be able to clean up this Slade gang tonight. I got him locked up, boys. Good work, Sheriff. Hey? I say that's good, Sheriff. But what's going to happen when Jake comes back? Do you know where Slade is? Sure. Trigger says he's up in Box Canyon. He's sure going to be plenty mad. Sheriff, I got one more job for you. Are you talking to me? Yeah, come along. I want to talk to you. Oh, I thought you said something about another job. <laughs> I want you to meet up with the fightingest United States Marshal in the Plains, Lightning Jim Whipple. <laughs> Thanks, boys. I ain't much at making speeches, but what I got to say concerns every one of you. Yeah. Now, I know all about Jake Slade and his gang. I know he's got a pack of hired gunmen that have been killing folks and stealing your cattle. <laughs> Now, Bill here tells me there's about 50 men in Slade's gang. Well, there's almost that many right here. And I reckon you all know how to use a shooting iron. Now, you wanted Bill to be a sheriff, but you didn't back him up. Now, one man can't beat the Slade gang, but I'll wager my life that all of us can clean up Slade's gang in a jiffy. Now, this ain't a fight to catch a few outlaws. This is a fight to make the Midville country safe for honest, decent folks. Sure, yeah, 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 yeah. Right. To establish the kind of law and order that will rid the plains of the outlaw and desperado. Yeah, sure. yeah, right. Well, are you going to let Slade run Midville? Or are you willing to stand up and fight? All right, yeah. let's go. What's the trouble, Dad? What? I say, what are you doing up here? Oh, Trigger's in jail. What? I said, Trigger's in jail. What for? Tried to steal a horse, and Bill Barnes slapped him in jail. You mean Bill Barnes come back? Yep, he's back at the jail. Throwed me out, said he dared you to come back and get Trigger. Oh, he did, eh? Hey, never mind. We'll get Trigger. <laughs> Boys, we're getting triggered out of here now. Yeah, Bill Barnes, we'll get him. Yeah, we'll get him. Howdy, boys. I thought I told you to clear out, Bill. Yeah, that's right, Jake. But you see, I'm the legal sheriff here. <laughs> well, boys, here's like Bill don't take good advice when he gets it. Jake, as sheriff of Midville, I'm arresting you and your whole gang. Yeah? Well, you ask for it. Reach for the sky. Fix. No, you don't. Get him, boys. <laughs> Get 
Yeah, we got him. You've been dreaming about him. There was plenty hot fight for that last, did I tell you that? Yeah, it sure was, buddy. Good work, Lightning. Thank the Lord you boys didn't get hit. We're all right, Paul. How about the rest of the boys? Just a few bullet creases. We got all the Slade's men, I Yeah, we got them all right. Yeah, yeah we'll go yeah. I said you could beat them, and you did. And it was Lightning and Jim got the boss of this dirty outfit, Jake Slade. And here he is. String him up. String him up. That bloody dog. Hold on, boys. Hold on. Jack's wounded. And if he lives... They're going to see that he gets a fair trial. What is it, Dad? I went up to Box Canyon to fetch Slade and his gang back here to jail. When I was up there in the canyon, I seen the cattle that was stole from the Circle J. I'd like to get my hands on that double-crossing old Duluth. No, Slade. Dad wasn't double-crossing you. He acted under my orders. Yeah? And who are you? Take a look at that badge he's wearing, Slade. It says United States Marshal. This is Lightning Jim. And when it comes to fast thinking and shooting, he's greased Lightning. We owe Lightning Jim a lot for helping bring law to Midville. Yeah, yeah, way to go. Lightning Jim's a best marshal on the plane. Say, Bill, this sheriff's badge Slade give me, it belongs to you. That's right, Dad. <laughs> the badge is Bill's if the boys still want him for sheriff. How about it, boys? Sure. Hooray right, for Bill. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, boys, thanks. I'll do my best to carry out the law and try to be as good a lawman as... I'm sure glad that I ain't the sheriff no more. Now, hold on there, Dad. Hold on. I reckon Bill's going to need a deputy. How'd you like to be a deputy sheriff? Hey? I said, how'd you like to be a deputy sheriff? I'm sorry, Lightning, but I can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> And so ends another thrilling chapter in the lives of United States Marshal Lightning Jim Whipple and his deputy, Whitey Larson. Mm -hmm.